it's a quite large uh, project. It's called PAL, uh, which stands for Personal Assistant for a Healthy Lifestyle. And this is um, a Horizon 2020 funded uh, European project. What he does is he, uh, he enhances the self-management of children with diabetes. And he does so by um, having discussions about difficult situation in diabetes. Um, he has educational uh, possibilities. And he can also play quizzes with children with diabetes in which we can find out or the children themselves can find out where the, um, uh, where the white spots are, what they no don't know or what they have to refresh. Uh, and on the other hand, it's, uh, it's also a real buddy because um, it helps the children overcome their fear for diabetes or for injections or blood measurements uh, and they can keep on communicating with him. So they can do it in the hospital with a physical robot, but if they go home, they see an avatar of Charlie on the internet and they can keep on communicating with him then. And after they come into the hospital again, Charlie can ask them about what they talked about, what the goals were and how they managed. He has brothers and sisters um, and they all have um, uh, different names, uh, but they're mainly used for uh, children with diabetes. Uh, because it's still uh, on an experimental basis and we are uh, developing a system that helps the children uh, in diabetes. But in the end I expect that uh, robots like Charlie can also be used for other chronic diseases like uh, asthma or in the treatment of obesity. So there are many possibilities for it.